But as we told you earlier, much of the growth in today's jobs number came from hospitality and leisure. But it's not just today's number where that's been the case. Simon Hobbs now with a look at this big jobs generator. Any deal? Whether it's that takeout franchise, the luxury hotel, drinking establishment, or the fitness staff at your gym, month after month, leisure and hospitality has consistently generated more jobs than other parts of the economy. In fact, of the almost 7 million non-farm jobs generated over the last four years, 18% have come from leisure and hospitality, according to the Bureau of Labour Statistics. It's partly because the industry is coming from a lower base, absolutely slammed in the wake of the financial crisis. Now business travellers are travelling again and tourists from home and abroad. You can see it in the results of big hotel brands like Marriott. What we've seen is uh, occupancy has built back to essentially peak levels and so we're full midweek. Uh, and we've seen that we've been able to both raise like-for-like like pricing, but also shift towards higher-rated business. Demand is also returning for the airlines, and as with the hotels, capacity or new supply remains restricted. So prices are rising, profits are rising, and operators have the cash to add back jobs and concentrate again on customer satisfaction. We have had rising airfares, we right. have had rising average daily rates for hotels, and that that's because there's good business right. and leisure demand. And those big fixed cost theme parks now teeming with visitors are again becoming major cash generators for the likes of Bob Iger over at Disney. What we did in California with Cars Land and the new Fantasyland in Orlando and that obviously helps a lot. So our product is being welcomed by our public and is in demand. Critics, of course, will argue that many of these jobs that are being created are low-skilled, low-wage, paying on average across the country below a supervisory level $11.15 an hour. For Nightly Business Report, I'm Simon Hobbs.